Sentry. Are we on? Yeah. I'm good. I'm probably going to end up having to mute at the moment I know I'm on those, so I don't hear the echo. Okay. I'm on. All right. Welcome, everyone. It's been a pleasure listening to all the previous speakers, and I hope that you've been beginning to get a vision of the dynamics of what this program can do, can do for you and for those that you care about. A wise man once said, find a purpose in life so big that it challenges your capacity to be at your best. Well, I believe I found that purpose in Q Sciences and in a program that I've been involved with for over 25 years, a program I'm going to help introduce many of you to. Many of you involved are already utilizing the Cellar Sizer, and some of those who aren't 
this is going to be a paradigm shift. This is going to be a whole different methodology of exercise, something that um, you may not have been exposed to before. But we all know the importance of exercise. Uh, and we probably all know somebody that's got knee problems, hip problems, back problems, digestion elimination problems, circulation problems, um, weight loss issues. We're going to be addressing a program that, that helps with each one of those. People that have stress, people that have a hard time sleeping at night, people that would like to tighten and tone. With typical exercise, we have been taught for years that you have to tear down to build up. Or you've got to do 20 minutes of aerobics in order to get a good aerobic conditioning. Or that you've got to sweat. Or that you have, there's, if there's no pain, there's no gain. And we see the fitness industry for years has capitalized on that and, and, and continue to do so. Most people are not going to go out and do some of these insanity type programs. It wears down the joints. It can be damaging to the ligaments and tendons. And it's difficult to do. When I began my program over 25 years ago now, I was an average insurance agent, um, an average looking insurance agent. I had a little uh, stomach, I had rounded shoulders, I had a little double chin, I was 5'10 and a half. Um, I started to do a program which in one month I dropped a belt notch, in one month my arms were bigger. My wife asked me, she says, are you lifting weights? I said, no, I'm just doing my little routine, 10 minute routine before I go to work. Well, in six months, I was standing erect, the stomach was gone, I was, um, I ended up, we don't know exactly when it occurred, but I ended up three quarters of an inch taller and uh, been measured by three doctors and one attorney, so I share that when I, when I lecture now. And I, I still do my 10 minute a day routine, um, but it's 25 years later. And again, it's, I'm not a bodybuilder, so I don't have a lot of muscle mass, but you can see that, I don't know if you can see online or not, but um, it, it tightens and tones the entire body. The strength and balance that I've received in my program is not unique to me. I'm going to share some testimonials with you as well, but um, the kind of strength that you get is a cellular strength, not just a muscular strength. For me to be able to stand here, I don't know if you're going to see me when I drop down, stick my leg out in front of me, sit all the way down to the ground, and then stand all the way up again. You could see. Um, that's, that's a kind of strength that you don't get from typical exercises, it's especially not just doing 10 minutes a day. My objective here is to help you. I don't know what it is that you need in your own physical health, but I do believe emphatically everybody needs what I'm about to share with you. Typical exercise has introduced numerous different types of exercise equipment. Um, you've heard of them, and I've shared them many times. Wedges, abdominal boards, rowers, ketoners, porta bikes, fitness climbers, stairmasters, health riders, Nordic track, swing air dines, life cycle, life rowers. The list goes on and on. We won't belabor it. But I wanted to share with you, and I'll do this a little bit every week, some of the testimonials that some of my customers, some of them for many, many years who have been with me, have, have shared with me, and we've got hundreds and hundreds of testimonials. If my program didn't work, I wouldn't still be doing it. It works. Um, I'm 57 years of age, and I still do my 10-minute-a-day routine. I can still do the things I was doing when I was in my 20s and 30s. In fact, my, my wife thinks I'm nuts sometimes, but I feel good. And remember, everybody watching this, you're not that old. Not really. Cells don't get old. Cells are always replacing themselves. But cells get weak. And when cells get weak from lack of exercise, from lack of proper nutrients or environment, well then our body parts and their functions also get weak. The good news, the great news, is that we can strengthen and improve the efficiency of our cells at any age. And when we strengthen and improve the efficiency of our cells, we automatically do the same thing to our body parts and their functions. I truly believe it. I've seen it. I, I hope for you who haven't experienced it that you will give it a, give it a try. Um, it'll, change, it'll change your life. But this is uh, Dwayne. Dwayne writes, I've used the cellar sizer, which I'm going to introduce you to in a moment, for over 10 years. I purchased a second cellar sizer approximately four years ago to have at our winter home in Florida. 
Previously, I had worn out and broken about 20 cheap rebounders and had nearly given up on having this type of conditioning available. My mother-in-law had given us a rebounder approximately 20 years ago. I saw the seller sizer on the internet and decided that I would spend the extra money in hopes that it would maybe last a year or two. As it turns out, I would have spent several times that money if I kept buying the Brand X rebounders and I would not have had the consistency I've experienced with the seller sizer. I highly recommend the seller sizer as I use it as part of my exercise conditioning routine every day. The great part of it is its consistency. It functions today exactly as it did 10 years ago. If anyone is having problems with the seller sizer making noise, and I have to, and I'm glad he pointed this out because we have people on the internet trying to tell other people the solar sizer is very squeaky and you're going to hear it really isn't if you do exactly what he's talking about. If anyone is having problems with the solar sizer making noise, a quick spray or drop of 3-in-1 oil of silicon lubricant at each end of the springs quiets it immediately. Thank you for a great piece of equipment that has not only lasted all these years but has helped me lose 60 pounds and maintain my health now for, for four years. Um, dear David, wanted to let you know how much your solar sizer has meant to me and my family. Before we purchased your solar sizer, we accumulated a nice collection of other exercise machines. We have the power walker, the cardio glide, the stationary bike, and some others that I'm almost too embarrassed to mention. Needless to say, we never use them much and we don't even think about them anymore. They did make a nice clothes hanger. I think I heard that from you, but it's true. Well, when I went to the Chicago Health Fair and saw that guy, David, jumping like a kid and having fun and saw what kind of shape he was in, I said, if he can look like that, that good, just by jumping on that thing, I got to have it. David, I've been, it's been everything you said it would be and more. We keep it right in, on our TV room, which is what we do. And my wife and I and my three boys all jump on it daily. One of the things that I really like about it is that even if I don't feel so motivated some days, when I get on it and just start with the health bounce before you know it, I'm doing the whole routine. And that's true. Solar size changes your physical um, processes within your body can improve them within just a few minutes. I'll talk about that in a moment. Um, dog, animals. Animals often love the solar sizer too. Um, I bought the solar sizer from you a few years ago in New York. I was trying to recover from mono. It was amazing. The machine had immediately jump-started my energy after seeing my doctors to help me boost some of my energy level. I spent thousands of dollars in search for a cure. This machine gave me my energy and my life back. Um, there's the David. It's a, David is a perfect testimony for the tremendous and far-reaching benefits of the regular use of the solar sizer. In only 10 minutes a day, muscle mass can be stimulated to grow without having to first tear it down through strenuous exercise. Without stressing the body or joints, using the solar sizer increases circulation and activates your cells to absorb more oxygen and vital nutrients. You've heard of this man. His name is Dr. John Gray. He wrote a book called Men Are From Mars, Women Are From Venus, and he's been a customer of mine for over 16 years. Um, one more. She said, Those regular hour-long video workouts were just tearing me out to where I would really dread them, and therefore do not do them it's so, so capitalized, much easier to work out with your solar sizer. It doesn't feel like work. Here's the thing about your solar sizer. People would just use it. They would see what you are talking about. We've had people of all ages. We've got a lady here who is 95 years of age. Um, and you see her on the solar sizer. She's been on it for almost a year now. And at 95 years of age, she's doing jumping jacks on the solar sizer. And she talks about how it saved her life. Um, her kids, I'll read one more. We've got so many, and like I said, I'll do a few every week. But again, people, we've got great testimonials from people with chronic fatigue syndrome, multiple sclerosis, fibromyalgia, weight loss issues, knee problems, hip problems, back problems. You all know somebody that, that is dealing with issues like that. 
Uh, we want to improve the immune system. I'm going to talk about how solar site can do that. Last one, it's been over six months since we put, purchased your solar sizer. <clears throat> More than enough time has gone by to really know this product. Honestly, it is the best exercise equipment I've ever invested in. I own and regularly use a Pilates machine, a Schwinn exercise bike, a Nordic, Nordic track, ab rocket, perfect push-up, free weight, and workout bench, bar dip, chin-up bar, etc. The solar sizer is used every day by my family, unlike the other equipment. We love it. The solar sizer is fun to use, it's easy to use, unlike some other equipment that we own. The overall health of each one of us has improved. We all look better and feel better. We have fewer colds now. Although one of my children was highly skeptical in the beginning when we first invested in the solar sizer, he now acknowledges that the solar sizer was worth every penny. The solar sizer is additionally easy to assemble, easy to transport, easy to store, and the customer support was fantastic. We are grateful to our Heavenly Father that he made this purchase, that we made this purchase, and that it has worked out so fabulously for each member of our family. Wanted to thank you for an absolutely terrific, high-quality product that has made such a positive difference in the life of each member of our household. Two parents in their 50s and three kids in their early 20s. Thank you, Mrs. Ginsburg. Thank you. So what is cellar size? Typical exercise works by lifting weight away from gravity. It limits the effect of the muscle doing the lifting. When you apply weight to a muscle, you are simply causing the stress or tension on that muscle to cause the cells of that muscle tissue to expand and contract with more weight or stress against the cell membrane. The cell, in response to the weight, simply fortifies this membrane with more protein to compensate for the increased amount of weight because the cell doesn't want to rupture. But the cells don't really care where the weight comes from or how sophisticated the equipment is. So suppose there was one exercise which instead of lifting weight away from gravity, which limits the effect again to the muscle doing the lifting, what if we could increase the weight of gravity against every single cell membrane, every muscle in your entire body, and do it over 100 times per minute? We'd have a whole different methodology of exercise. We would just need a piece of equipment that would allow us to do it. And that's where the cellular sizer comes in. When I first entered the industry, there was something known as, and there is today, something known as rebounders or mini trampolines. When I began, every mini trampoline on the market was utilizing a little tube spring of this type of design. This little tube spring would stretch only a little bit, and you may have experienced them before. At the end of the stretch, they come to an abrupt stop or jar. It was so severe it could break the spring. It could also damage the person using it. My dad attempted to do my exercises on a typical rebounder in 1995. He was permanently disabled. The jarring effect of coming down without the support put a bone fragment right to a nerve in his lower back. And he, uh, he didn't, uh, he's never been able to recover from that, unfortunately. But he's one of my biggest fans, and I'm and always have been one of his. This is what I introduced in the early 90s. A larger tapered spring design, larger diameter in the middle with a gradual taper. It keeps the weight in the middle of the spring and allows the body to gently decelerate and accelerate through the gradual taper. Well, then you don't have the jarring effect, but you have G-forces. We'll talk about that in just a moment. But the pumping action up and down creates weight as you decelerate and then accelerate again. Well, virtually everybody, or many, most of the mini trampoline markets that I was aware of, started to produce tapered spring designs. The problem is when the steel in the spring is weak, it can look the same until you stand on it. When it's weak and you stand on it, the feet sink and pronate, and that can cause ankle problems, knee problems, and lower back problems. So I then introduced the triple tier tapered spring. You can see the difference. It actually has ridges. It has a larger diameter, a ridge where it tapers, and then another ridge where it tapers again. That ridge helps to focus the weight toward the center of the spring, where exactly where we want the spring to stretch. If you need more spring because you're weighing, you weigh more or you're jumping higher, then you can graduate to the next ridge, the next tier, and so forth, so you never come to an abrupt stop or jar. 
We patented this spring design. No one else has it. it we call it the Triflex spring, and it goes with the trifold solar sizer. So let me show you the solar sizer, how simple this is to utilize. Great testimonials on that as well. I take it with me in the overhead luggage bin when I travel commercially. But this is a, this is a trifold. I'm going to move the screen just a little bit so you can see that. It's sitting on another one. But to open it, this is my personal unit. It's about nine, nine years old. Um, and it's in great shape. I mean, it's, it's a little weathered, but I, I want to demonstrate it so that you can see how well built they are and how long they last. Um, we don't know. <laughs> it's designed. I want it to last a lifetime. But this is what the solar sizer looks like. You can lie it down on the ground and open it literally in less time than it takes me to put on a pair of running shoes. It's done. This is the solar sizer. It's all, all opened up. The legs fold over. They're held in place by heavy duty piano wire, one of the best wires you can get. So you don't have to worry about it getting stripped, stuck, or lost. The rubber tips aren't rubber. They're a polymer. They last for years. We've never worn one out, even out in the sun, the rain, and the snow. The springs do not connect directly into the frame, so we never wear the frame out. We drill 36 holes through the frame, put steel pins through the holes, and connect, e connect each spring to the pin. So the frame will last virtually forever. The matte material, this is not made out of canvas, not in our plastic like you can find on typical units. Canvas, nylon, and plastic mats look the same, but they can stretch rotten mildew, and when they stretch, your feet pronate. And if you were to alter the angle of your body in different positions, if your foot rolls on you, then you could ser suffer serious ankle problems, knee problems, or, or um, back problems. Our mat material is a space-age material made here in the United States. It's the highest quality. It's a polypropylene where every fiber is put under nearly 200 tons of pressure. It's so dense, you're not going to stretch it out. You can leave it out in the sun, the rain, the snow, it doesn't matter. It's all weather resistant, but it supports your feet. You can do different movements, and the response time on our cellar size is not sluggish, like you can get with bungee cords or rubber bands. Once they warm up, you don't want to do my exercises on it. It can, be, uh, it can, be, uh, it can create a serious problem. So... I'm ready to demonstrate solar size, and I'm going to show you some of the techniques. And I know you're running a little late, so I don't want to take up too much of your time. I'm grateful to be able to do it from my office because the weather here in Manti has been hitting us all day with um, snow blizzards. So I'm grateful to be here. When I get ready on the solar sizer, I usually get my solar size outfit, which just consists of either socks or bare feet, and I do that because the foot wants to move. The muscles and the ligaments want to move. And with typical exercise when you're using a, an actual uh, shoe, then your foot is restricted in its ability to move. And over a period of time, that can actually cause foot problems. So we were built, we were designed to have the foot be more flexible. And the cellar sizer helps to promote that. It's helped numerous, I, I don't even know how many people with, with foot problems, ankle problems, arch problems, um, strengthen and improve the overall support of the foot again. So, this is what I start off every morning with what I call the baby bounce. It's a gentle movement up and down. This gentle movement up and down also moves all the fluid of your body up and down. I'll wake up in the morning, get on the solar sizer, and I'll notice within two to three minutes of just that moving up and down, I'll notice any puffiness around the eyes just start to disappear because I'm getting all the fluid moving. But as I'm moving up and down, the thyroid, the adrenals, the endocrine system, liver, kidney, spleen, gallbladder, pancreas, pineal gland, brain activity, vestibular balance, vision, everything is gently being massaged. That, it, it's the best wake-up call. If you can look at your blood underneath the microscope, when most people wake up, the blood has a tendency to be more sticky. It's called sticky blood. And the blood cells don't circulate as well. They're starved for oxygen and nutrients. Um, you get on a solar sizer and you start to move up and down, and within three to five minutes, the blood cells become separated, oxygenated, and energized. They have access to the nutrients. 
they circulate more freely through the body. You feel better. Well, there's no wonder the body is functioning more efficiently just through that gentle movement up and down. It also activates the lymphatic or circulatory system. The lymphatic system is dependent upon pressure changes to have the immune system, lymphatic system working efficiently. So as you're moving up and down and the fluid is moving up and down, you're creating these pressure changes up and down. Those one-way valves in the lymphatic system are opening and shedding, creating an internal vacuum system of suction. So it helps to keep us healthier. It helps to increase circulation through bones and joints. Um, most important physical activity people, I teach people can do. So I'll do the gentle movement up and down. It helps to open up blood vessels and back flushes arteries and, or the actual valves. So two to three minutes of that is my wake-up call. It's also a great way to go to sleep at night if you're having a hard time sleeping, if you're stressed or distressed. You'll notice a parent instinctively often take a baby, put them over their shoulder, and they gently bounce the baby up and down. And what does the baby do? They gently re they, they relax. They can e even fall asleep. Well, most of you watching this are too big to be put over somebody's shoulder. But you can get on the solarizer for two to three minutes at night. I'll do it. I can't tell you the number of people. There's so many people have called to thank me for this because I did it for me. I didn't realize it was going to help so many more people, but I'll get on the solarizer, put my fingertips straight down, gently move up and down, relax the shoulders, back and buttocks, just gently relax, do that for about two to three minutes, and then I go back to sleep and I'm gone. I, you don't have to toss and turn to get rid of the stress or tension. And, and people say, well, you shouldn't exercise at night because it wakes you up. No, they're actually having studies, new studies that are coming out saying now that you can exercise at night and it can help you sleep better. Well, this definitely helps me sleep a lot better. So two to three minutes of the wake-up call is the best way to wake up in the morning and one of the best ways that I, I know of going to sleep at night. <coughs> then, I do my aerobic exercise. You can start off so simple. We have a balance bar here. And I don't know, yep, you can see the balance bar, so you can hold on to the balance bar, and it, it, so virtually anybody can do it. Hold on to the balance bar and rock left to right. As I'm rocking left to right, I'm dropping the hips into the mat. So as the hips are dropping into the mat, I'm starting to loosen the lower lumbar. But I'm also working the thighs and the knees. If you want to exercise a little more vigorously, just lift the knees up higher. And if you want to train for a special athletic event, well, there's nothing to stop you from doing this. You do that for a few minutes, you'll have steam coming out of your eyeballs. It's a vigorous aerobic activity. But I left things out, such as barking, biting dogs, dogs rain puddles, potholes, carbon monoxide poisoning, curbs, mailboxes, rollerbladers, or <laughs> other foreign things that jump out at you. The solar sizer is convenient. You can do this at home with the air conditioning on, the heater, in the safety of your own home with the lock on the door. Every, one size fits virtually, well it does, it fits all feet. Um, the gentleman here was uh, with the Miami Heat. Is that right? Yep. And let me tell you, he's got big, big, big feet. Robert Branson, also one of our customers. So, it's, it's convenient for everybody to use. Everybody does use it. So, that's an aerobic exercise. Now, you can start off, you can do calisthenics. When I began, and again, it was one of my, one of my objectives was to, I can't see that because of the light, but um, one of the objectives was to flight, flatten and tighten the stomach. And it's a vanity thing, I know that, but... <laughs> I didn't have good balance, I held on to a door jam. Now we have a balance bar that you can hold on to. I tilt backwards a little bit and just kick my legs out. As I kick my legs out, I leverage the weight right here. See, subtle size is the only exercise that can really claim to be an isometric for toning, an isotonic for building, that's weight bearing, a calisthenic for targeting, but even though you're targeting different areas of the body the way I'm showing now, the rest of the body is also involved collectively together. So it's getting strong at different angles collectively. That's very unique. 
It's aerobic for conditioning. You've got 75 trillion cells, every cell in your body flexing over 100 times per minute. And it's a um, flexibility program. You don't even have to stretch. I don't know if you can see this or not, but I don't stretch, but I can still put my hands flat on the ground. And it's uh, cells become more flexible as you continue to cellar size because the cells are being massaged. So then I do the, uh, after I've done the, well, stomach exercise, if you want to tighten underneath the chin, you do the same thing. Hold on to the balance bar. You can jog, tilt backwards. All these muscles are leveraged. They're all tight right now. And I'm putting weight on them just by coming down. Or you can leverage more weight by kicking out. You can tilt your head back. And when I tilt my head back, I'm now working underneath the chin as well as the, the neck muscles. For the weights and the hips, great one. Um, I just kick out side to side. Every time I come down, I'm putting all this weight right here. But it's also on the rest of the body. That's why cellular size is so efficient. That's why in 10 minutes a day, you can do it because you're not targeting all these individual groups at the expense of the others. I've got a message warning. Poor network connection. Okay, I hope it's still working. Um, lower back and buttocks. You can lean forward from my hips. I just kick back. This is a great one for lifting, tightening, and toning the whole backside. The second most important activity that I, that I teach is to loosen the lower back, important, and improve digestion elimination processes. That's critical, critical for good health. We can take all the nutrients we want. If we're not absorbing them, then we can't utilize them. And there's a mucous membrane lining that has a tendency as we get older to accumulate within the colon or the intestinal wall itself. It prevents us from having access to those nutrients. And so this, this movement right here um, was inspired by my, by my late wife. Um, and, and it's just it's a wonderful movement. As I gently twist side to side, I'm putting my, and I'm on the mat the whole time, I am putting my intestines and my colon through a little washing machine. But I'm also taking the liver, kidney, spleen, gallbladder, pancreas, and the adrenals. And rather than living a static existence all day long, which doesn't do much here, I'm moving up and down and side to side. I'm stimulating the, the actual internal organ function as I'm gently moving up and down and twisting side to side. That, most people, within two to three weeks, feel like a different person after they've been solarizing because the body parts and functions are working more efficiently again. For weight loss, I'm going to show you this one. This is, this is powerful. I call it the Jamba Run. Now, we can start off with the Jamba Walk. The Jamba Walk, can you see that? I'm on the mat, my feet are spread apart, uh, spread apart, yeah, apart about shoulder distance. And I keep my back straight, my feet flat. You can hold on to the balance bar, but you don't want to lean forward. It takes the weight off the thighs. The thighs are the biggest muscles of the body. They have the greatest demand. They will give us the fastest results. So I keep my back straight, my feet flat. I just push into the mat just like this. And my feet are on the mat the whole time. Um, I guarantee you, within 30 seconds, you're going to start to really feel it. Because those muscles are big. They will eat up the sugars, the energy available in the bloodstream very quickly because of that. And when you do repetitions of it, and you've already eaten up your fuel, now it has to find more fuel. Guess what it goes after? It goes after the fat or the white adipose tissue. Now, as you get stronger and the knees get stronger, you can start off very gently. But as they get stronger, instead of doing the jamba walk, you now do the jamba run. And it's the same thing, but instead of lifting my feet up off the mat, I'm pushing down into the mat, and I'm doing it very quickly. I guarantee you in 20 seconds, I don't care how good a shape you're in, you're going to feel that. Within a month of doing that, virtually everybody is, is bounding up and down stairs almost two at a time. But as they're going up the stairs, their strength and their knees have improved dramatically. The skeletal system is supported by the muscles and the ligaments. 
we don't want to tear them down. We want to build them up. The idea of you've got to tear down to build up, you don't. In fact, that doesn't create a healthy muscle. When you tear down to build up, that's a sport. Nothing wrong with it, but it's a sport. And as with many sports, it can be damaging to the body, especially accumulatively over a period of time. The muscles that you look on, look at on a cat or a dog, they're very, very soft, very pliable, very quick. If you don't tear down to build up, you don't build up the acids in the muscle. You don't tear this, they don't, when, they, when you tear down to build up, they tell you to do it every other day because the body literally has to repair itself. When you cellar size, and I'm not a bodybuilder, so my muscles aren't as big as a bodybuilder, but, but my muscles are very, very soft. They're very, very pliable. Um, <laughs> One of the doctors I read about earlier today, I was lecturing with him, and he had me come up in front of a group of people. I said, David, I've read about muscles like yours. I've never really seen one. Um, and he had me come up there, and he uh, had me relax my muscle, and he said, flex, or relax, and he felt the muscle, and, and it, it's weird. It's, it's like, well, if you've ever looked at a muscle on a cat or a dog, when they're soft, they're just really, you can almost push into their bone. They're very, very soft. Well, then he had me flex it, and it was very strong. He said, that's one of the healthiest muscles I've ever seen. And that's what we want. We don't want to compromise our health by tearing down our body and putting more stress or distress on it, and we don't have to. Cellular size does it very easily. You can target the different areas of the body. If you want to build up your biceps, you can do a resistance movement, isot isometric, put a little more resistance on it as you're pulling it and pushing down. And then with that isometric, Add an isotonic. Do, do this for a minute, if you can. <laughs> it's intense. Much more intense than just doing it like this. Because um, the whole body is working collectively together. Um, you can arch your back, pull, and push in for your upper body chest area. That's a terrific exercise. A couple more, and then I'm going to have James who's there. Um, James is going to work at showing some of you uh, why cellar size it is not typical exercise and how it gives an enormous amount of strength and balance. But this one here, for the hips, inner, outer thigh, lateral knee, both sides of the knee, you can stand on one side of the mat, jump across to the other side, just add a little hop to it, and you're working hips, thighs, and knees. Very simple, very effective. As you get stronger, you can sit down a little further, you have to go faster, or you can put your feet together and go skiing. It's the same burn feeling you would have if you were on the slopes. That is all I'm going to share with you today. There's a natural facelift. I talk about how to open up the bronchial tubes and the lungs. We have a DVD available. It's called Cellar Size, the ultimate exercise. It explains what this is why it works, it shows you how to use it, shows you what I do in my 10 minute a day routine, but then it also has a personal trainer drop down menu that addresses over 20 different techniques for shoulders, movements that you can do to open up the shoulder rotator cuff, for opening up the back and the vertebrae, lower back as well. You've got over 20 various different techniques that you can do. Um, but in addition to that, that DVD, that DVD becomes a tool for you to help with others that might be struggling with some of the issues that we talked about earlier. And at, at the same time, you don't, have to, you don't have to know all the information. Have them come over to a home party or get together with them and show the DVD. When they're done watching the DVD, then challenge them the way that James is going to show you in just a moment, in their strength and balance. When the, you've done, you've challenged all of them, and 99% of them will fail. When you've challenged them all, then bring out the cellar sizer. Open it up, or if you have it open, just make sure they don't jump on it ahead of time. Then have them all get on the cellar sizer. James, when you, when you do this, I want, I want the people that are there to feel the muscles up here flexing. Every time you bounce up and down. So as they're moving up and down, 
Have them flex those muscles as they grab the shoulders, the deltoids, grab the biceps and gentry right. Okay, all right, that's, that's fine. Um, and then feel the stomach muscles. And when, you, when you're done, he'll do the strength and balance test on you again. And if the light bulb doesn't go on, you need more information, give me a call. But we welcome you all to experience the Cellarcizer. Enjoy it, and it will become one of your best friends for the rest of your life. Thank you. I, I hope this has worked, and it's, it's been a pleasure being able to share this with you. You're with a group of people right now who want to build people while they're building a business. And I can't think of a more noble group of people to be with personally. And I'm grateful to be and honored to be associated with, with all of you. Thank you.